Hello everyone and welcome to Sunday Showdown 12, 12th edition today. I am Gil Stomaraid, one of your one half of your commentary duo. I am joined by Rod today. That's me. Or you can call me H Rod, uh, Ash Rod, uh, Harod. I have many names. <laughs> <laughs> and um, yeah, today we'll be uh, clashing blades as yeah. usual monthly with East London fighters. Um, we have, as usual, a Macherino that we can pop in the chat right now with exclamation mark Macherino. Remember, we raise a uh, prize pot crowdfunded with the community. You can uh, donate in different ways. Uh, you have uh, a <clears throat> free code to pop in there authenticate yourself with uh, social media pop the free code in there you can uh, donate uh, 50p uh, just absolutely for free it doesn't come out of your pocket and also you have sponsor quests on the right uh, uh, so you can check the sponsors uh, do the quest and some other money will be added we also have options for you know just a free donation if you're feeling extra generous we have uh, apparel from uh, east london fighters with the you know, swaggy t-shirts. And also we have custom made beads that I've been doing. Uh, I can actually show you one right now, free, that <coughs> is there. Yeah, they look pretty great. Yeah, that's a handy. It's a bit sunny, yeah. so you, I don't know if, <gasps> if you can see it. But yeah, you can, you know, get that with your character, your color, and you can contribute yeah. to the price spot. We are very excited for today. And also we are very excited for tech tech and lockdown eh, lockdown league two because the the pools are gonna start soon right rod yeah the pools um uh, are starting um, there, there's a uh, pool uh, reveal on monday which Ooh. is tomorrow um, so uh, look forward to Getting some tech and action elf mm -hmm. is where the magic happens so stay tuned for more <laughs> fighting game action and we're gonna have our first match as it looks like Jambish no, Jam Balak against uh, Turbo Chaco. So I'm mm -hmm. wondering if the pillar is coming, if he's playing, he's oh, looking the... for the opponent. There it is, and Jambish will... Balak on the Yoshitora. Yeah, will the pillar find us? Will it kill us? <laughs> like always. And Jambish Balak always rocking that Yoshitora. So I know my brother is um, rooting for him in the, in the background. <laughs> yes, in the shadows. In the shadows. I'll be watching, I'll be waiting <laughs> in the shadows. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, welcome everyone uh, to Sunday Showdown and uh, let's get into the action. Um, mm. What are you expecting? Like, I, I, uh, I'm expecting Chaco to take this, but we'll see. I'm also expecting Chaco, but you never know, you never know. I, I know that Jean-Michel Balek is uh, a guy who always um, plays a lot. Uh, um, tries tries um, a lot of things out, so can be a surprise. So let's see. Yeah. I'm nice seeing start some, from Chaco. I'm seeing some new stuff from Chaco. Mainly, yeah, the use of that jumping D as a cross up, which is mm -hmm. interesting. Yeah. Nice. Who gets the grab? Sweep. Ooh, that was too obvious. Ooh, gets the ooh, three, three swings. And oh. the deer where beautifully it, sniped. It will find you. It will find you and it will kill you. <laughs> it's at, it's every time. Ooh. Ooh. Now you could FTP. <laughs> Ooh, block all of those. Nice. Hard knockdown. No jump in C on him though. The DP is not no. that scary, so I think it's a mm. good uh, it's a good way to apply Both pressure. Times. There's also like three swords already unlocked, right? Yeah. So four more to go. Ooh, this this should oh, be a full a combo. combo. No, where's the where's the arsenal? Oh, for the raffle shuffle. Ooh, could have. Uh, it's cool. Come and grab. Let's get the pillar again. Oh, nice block. Oh wow! Usual jump into common grab. Ooh, nice. But, yeah, jump Michel Balak with the uh, crouch D, right? Yeah, yeah. It's, uh, no, that's a uh, crouch heavy. Actually. Is it easy Crouch D? I think it's Crouch D. <laughs> yeah, it looks like Crouch D. Also, yeah, shout um, out to there in the chat. Okay, half, with... half life already gone. Yeah. Oh, nice. Botan. It's like uh, the cousin of Tsumimi Okay. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Both on Ray. Oh! 
Botan. It's like uh, the cousin of Tsumimi Gaishi. Okay. 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 Both on rage. Oh, did you do that? Why would you do that? Oh, oh my god! The, the damage! The most unsafe <laughs> shit! What, maybe he wanted to catch him by surprise, I don't know. He expected know. him to, to pr press a button, I don't know. <laughs> okay, ah. we got 1 0 for uh, Chaco with the East. And Chaco is like, you know what? If you want to take the risk, you're going to pay the consequences. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. Also, I would happens. like to understand uh, what happens in the East end because the pillar doesn't have a sharp blade, so that the screen goes black. And what happens? Do they just get bonked in the head with the pillar, and that's it? <laughs> Fantastic. I mean, imagination. <laughs> and uh, maybe he got some pocket uh, pocket knives. I don't know. Mm. I wanted to go back to the um, the first round of that match when you know mm. the first DP whiffed and uh, yeah. Chaco just used the close heavy into the the three recast to save the mm. step. Very very smart. You never yeah. know when you you're gonna need it. Yeah, especially uh, such an um, uh, important SSM. Uh, not not SSM, but I would say weapon flipping uh, okay. like, uh, one fools. Yeah, there it is again. Three recast. Good mm -hmm. money. Oh, no, nah, no. Nah. What's that? Nice. Uh, yeah, let me get the volume down, sorry. Yeah. We hear too much. <laughs> it's okay. Yeah, no worries, no worries. <laughs> right. Ooh, that was nice. Get sweeped. Botan? <laughs> now, now we go for the mix. Mm, why? Yes. Yeah, it's not gonna get deterred from you know using DDPs. It's made hmm. the message clear, so yeah. it's up to that. To that. At, at least either sweep or botan, but never DP though. <laughs> Ooh, nice jump in C. This, this can be a little bit tricky. Mm, had to dash in. No Connecting in dash go. Ah, again. It's, it's really really tricky to um, uh, combo after the jump C from Yoshitora. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it got it has to be deep. Yeah. Uh, Spanish once again, nice. forty percent gone. 50. Now he's in the corner. Yes. Okay, somebody plays Yuri in Kewa. <laughs> 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 That's exactly the same link with Yuri, you yeah. know, the same phasing into into the Rekka. Fantastic. One yeah. one. Wow, with the score. Yeah, it was a pretty quick round from uh, talk about nice DP from Michel uh, Jean Michel Balek. And again, he's swinging. But Jomish Balek doesn't yeah, want well, anything of that. Goes with the armor move. Yeah, yeah nice. Now the DPs are are hitting. He's doing something right. Yeah, it's because uh, it's because uh, Chaco has uh, you know started to be like, oh, okay, I punished him hard, he's not gonna do it again. And he's doing it again. <laughs> so that's part of you know <laughs> the adapting uh, process. Yeah, that's true. Ooh, no, okay. Oh, they could have oh. Huh? The but wasn't ready to capitalize. Oh, nice punish. You have to punish it early. Nice, Botan. Okay. Wow. Just in time to pick up the pillar. He'll be safe from this. Huh? Wants to finish this round. Nice burst. Ouch. Yes. Oh, that was. Uh, that was unlucky. <laughs> That's unlucky from Turbo Chaco and Jomi Shabalek, he takes his chance and gets the second match. So we have 1-1. One, one. Yeah, 1-1. One, one. He is adapting uh, uh, to Chaco for sure. He's using mm -hmm. the guard points in uh, smart ways. He's still forcing his DP despite what happened in game one, which is, you know, another point. You can either take the safe route and stop DPing, but then your opponent will pressure you more, or mm -hmm. you can keep the risks, but if the DP hits, you have an okay to work with. Yeah. So there's this duality of approaches that uh, is always interesting in fighting games. Um, in general, Chaco, I think, is getting a little bit greedy with the punish on the crush D because mm -hmm. he never used it. Sometimes even just getting like you know a jab out can be useful, and it's still frame advantage if you think about it, right? You don't get a knockdown, you don't get a lot of damage, you still get frame advantage to then pressure off of it or beta DP. But yeah. it's always going 
with like a medium int red cast to try and get the, the max damage and that is not always uh, practical. Yeah, that's true. Sometimes the little punishes do more mental damage than you think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Now for the last match. Nice DP from the Mongolian man. <laughs> Remember, he's not Chinese. Yes. Oh, nice, conversion. Got blocked. nice conversion also from the jump deeds mm. and, uh, you know, the pokes to it confirm. Oh, nice, but okay, out of the corner. Mm -hmm. Jump C barrage. Why not? You Yoshitora. Yeah. Nice, nice punish. Oh, yeah. oh, okay. okay. Maybe he was something wild. Oh, he pressed the button. Well, <laughs> that's not a big problem for one. No, no, that's true. Like, yeah. Oh, <laughs> buried, <laughs> buried <laughs> in the grass. Like, this is how you would sleep, boy. <laughs> Imagine um, uh, it would be like Street Fighter Five, where the um, uh, feet are looking out of the floor. That would, yeah. <laughs> that would be, that would be nice <laughs> with the move. Like one fools. Oh, doesn't get the six six play knocked down. Mm. Now he has to fight for the pillar. Nice okay. job from Jean Michel Black attacking the now, pillar. But it's like it doesn't have uh, the, the weapon, of course, the damage uh, that you can eat is less. You can force to be in that situation. Mm. Oh, nice grab. Gets the knockdown. Again, the jump C. Yeah. Nice running up grab, nice. Could have done WFT though. Mm -hmm. Maybe didn't want to do because of the burst. Ooh, okay. Okay. Burst on the pillar. Now no chance to get the pillar back. It was really risky. Okay, okay DP. Uh, you know, uh, we are now in uh, round three, and only mm -hmm. one character has the bar. <laughs> so yeah. Yeah, the SSM is still uh, on deck though, so yeah. you never know. So he still has a chance, but it's gonna be harder for Yoshitora, even though Yoshitora has a lot of um, tricks under his sleeves. It can be possible. The delay on that 668 to avoid the guard point, you know, mm -hmm. he, he ran into him, but it just kind of delayed a little bit to avoid the guard point and get the, the, the knockdown. No confirm though. Ooh, that was sweet. Yeah, see nice. here. See here, he always tries to go for the big reward. Mm-hmm. DP. Yeah, I think the for the light DP, uh, the, the SSM one for it is a bit slow. Uh, so it's kind of risky to try and punish uh, with the SSM. Mm, Shami is very jump. <laughs> Yeah, but Chaco right now is too focused on the aggressive phase rather than the reading phase, so it's yeah. hard to push his uh, gameplay too much and it's not really seeing what Michel Balak is doing and how he could be exploiting that. It looks nice, oh, nice cross up from with the pillar. It's gonna be really nice DP. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> wow! <laughs> it's like, what are you doing down there, boy? The pillar is coming and it's gonna yeah. get you. 2 it 1 for Chaco. 2 1 for Chaco, the pillar is inevitable. <laughs> it's not one foo that won, it's the pillar. One foo is the that... weapon, <laughs> the pillar is the, <laughs> is, is the character. <laughs> <laughs> there was good job. There was a good job from uh, Jean Michel Balak, but yeah. I also a lot of new stuff uh, uh, from Chaco. You know, the use of the overheaded range to, to combo with the late frames, uh, the jumping the cross ups, jumping the cross ups into pokes and confirm. Mm -hmm. Uh, I think he's, uh, he's been loving new things for the character, if that makes sense. You know, he's evolving his one foo, which is always nice to see. Uh, yeah. And you kind of need that because the character is good, but also has uh, a lot of situations in which you can struggle uh, to yeah, deal with, basically. Uh, we're going to have Snake in against uh, Logic. If I remember yeah. right, both are um, Rimuru players? Yes, or... yes, both. Yes, oh. both are Rimuru players. That'd be interesting. Um, yeah, so very good first match opening uh, for uh, Sunday Showdown 12 today. Mm -hmm. uh, once again, remember to check the Maturino guys, uh, and uh, we should be uh, getting the players in the game soon. Um, yeah, what, do you think of, uh, what do you think of Season 3? What do you think is going to happen? Because 
I seen, I don't know if many people have seen this, but um, SNK has teased both Ganon and uh, Cham Cham through mm. their Japanese um, Twitter account. They oh. posted both stages from uh, Samurai Showdown 2 uh, with some, you know, random quotes of, oh, what is, what are we cooking today or whatever for Cham Cham or what is this? What what is to merge under there and so on on the Cham Cham stage? So I don't know. I, I'm feeling hopeful for those two characters. They will make me really interested in the game. Of course, with maybe some improvements on the netcode and lobby system. Yeah, yeah. I think that um, uh, Ganon and Cham Cham are also uh, very um, uh, re re requested characters. Uh, also, Zika is very um, uh, re requested. So I hope they will um, uh, add uh, those characters in. I mean. So it's okay because my characters are all in, so <laughs> okay. that should be okay. Uh, but it would, it, it would be nice for those uh, fans of those characters. And also, I know that Ganon is really um, a popular um, uh, request, so that would be great. And um, maybe some balance changes, I don't know. Yeah. Could be. I, mean, I don't think the game is in a bad place, balance-wise. I think it's some, I think well, okay. Yoshiro, but Kyoshiro has kind of been a meme since the beginning, right? I think Kyoshiro is not that bad as people m may think. It's such that people don't take, perhaps don't take the time to to lap him. I don't know, because I don't think he's that he's that bad. But anyway, we got some Rimururu match. Pink on the left, blue on the right. Yeah. I don't I like know the because the yeah, pink is great. Yeah. Oh, nice attempt for a uh, cross up there. Just don't know. Just don't know who's who, because I only see as in K Coast. Yeah, I think Logic was on the left when we started, so Logic should be pink and uh, Snaking should be blue. Okay. It's normally the uh, the Snaking color. It goes with the original Mhm. Mm yeah, yeah, exactly. Nice back throw there into the corner. Very smart. Mm -hmm. Especially for a character is so. You know, heavily based on uh, setups and uh, mix-ups and so on. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Big, yeah, big whiff there. Uh, that, w that was round one for sure. I would have been yeah. surprised if, uh, if anything else had happened. Yeah, so it was it was really hard to make a comeback, and uh, Logic takes it him, uh, takes the first round. Mm -hmm. so we're gonna see a lot of Donta case <laughs> and a lot of Conrus. It's funny Donta because Donta they. The character has ways around the around mix-ups, you know, like mm. staying on the ice cube uh, when uh, when the Tondeke comes in and then playing the mix-up from there on the opponent. Uh, but they also have a, a great way to with punish uh, uh, each other. So mm -hmm. it's quite interesting despite being a mirror. Yeah, that's true. It's really interesting. Mm, no confirmed though. I see ice everywhere, even though it's summer. Yeah, I don't know where they're picking. I don't know where they're picking up the ice in South America, but okay. <laughs> <laughs> Magic. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Just accept it. Okay, no. doesn't it? Interestingly, it would have been covered by the ice cube plus. There was a recovery from the throw. Who gets the grab? Yeah. Then Stupid. just one more. Ooh. Manages to of the Tondeke, but gets clipped by a standing medium. That was clean from um, uh, Snake. Didn't lose his, even his nerves. Which is a big deal in Samson. Mm -hmm. well, yeah, he bursts, he, he, do, he doesn't want to lose his weapon. Yeah, understandable. Like, she's not a great character without the weapon at all. Like, she has 66A and she has running D, which is a double mm. head blow, but other than that, not the greatest tools. Yeah. But now, logic with the advantage. Yeah, because Snake doesn't have his bar anymore. Mm. Still SSM. Still available. And the life lead. To be honest, I would burst like before actually uh, medium two because any throw can go into WFT and this point he can kill. Mm -hmm. so might as well take the advantage, you know what I mean? It's not round four, so might as well. Mm. I, and I also, you can, you can remove the, the, the fireballs, you can remove the tondeke at all. Like, you cannot tondeke, otherwise, you eat sent from full screen. 
So don't just like, in my opinion, of course, this is my commentator opinion. Don't just wait yeah. for the last moment to to use the, your rage explosion when you can yeah. get a big advantage like that. Yeah, sometimes people are like, oh, I have time, I have uh, enough life, um, uh, but sometimes just but like uh, right now the situation is even. You know what yeah. I mean? Like but now, that big advantage is not gonna count as much. With the jump that was really risky. Oof, Ooh, wow, nice! nice. <laughs> it was a nice finish. Yeah, manages to make it fall on the uh, on the opponent with a jump D, I believe it was yeah. the first hit, right? Nice timing. Yeah, 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 yeah. That was really nice. Timing. Nice coordination from Rimuru and her partner in crime, Konoru. <laughs> the ice spirit. The ice spirit, yeah. Oh, 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 I think it's odd because she she got an eye spirit and Nakoruru, which is his, uh, her sister, is like she has a hawk. I was like, okay. <laughs> I mean, uh, I think it's too many people with like you know eyes and fire. If you count uh, Kazuki and Sojetsu and mm. you know Ada and all these people, it's like okay, let's change it a bit. Ooh, yeah, that's true. Damage. Well, that was a lot of damage. Yeah. Oof. Big Konru. Yeah, rage field, <laughs> Conru. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now logic has to work for um uh, for the comeback. <sighs> Not gonna mm -hmm. I still believe. And I jinxed it, probably, like always. <laughs> it's a commentator's curse. Nice, nice, nice. He ran under the, um, the high's uh, platform as soon as he saw the jump back. It's like, you know what, if I'm not there, he cannot hit me. Yeah, very smartly played from uh, Snaken in this case. It's, a, it's a very mobile mirror as well, because they have very good, you know, running speed and uh, walking speed and so on. They're, they're very mobile characters. Nice, 50% mm. of the hit. the full punish. <laughs> Welcome to Sam show. Ooh, wow. <laughs> Not only was saved by the throw, he was able to combo off the Tondeke. Damn. Oh, I know I know what to do in uh, the balance patch. <laughs> <laughs> Nerf <Nerfed> this, <laughs> please! <laughs> yeah, it's funny because at the beginning she was like a very non-used character. And mm -hmm. then with buffs, uh, she's like a mainstay of, you know, Sunday Showdown. A lot of people use her. Nice. Yeah. And uh, Snake and takes that. Yeah, without letting um, uh, Logic the chance to uh, to rage burst. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you have to rage burst, even though you think you can. Um, uh, uh, I know you you can save it for later, but sometimes it's better to rage than not to rage. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. I think it's also like a little stigma from uh, the beginning of the game where people didn't really know how to play and they would rage mm. earlier and then they understand, oh, that was a mess up. Yeah. But and there is uh, late and there is very, very late. Yeah, or, or too late, actually. Yeah. Exactly. yeah. <laughs> nice forward throw, keeps her in the corner. Mm. She's nice. Yeah, nice overheads. One of the uh, few overheads that do a knockdown. Mm -hmm. Especially after the patch. Yeah, and also insane range of that overhead. And most mm -hmm. overheads are really hard to punish in this game. Like, yeah. you don't get more than. Uh, um, Ooh, nice than conversion. Punish, really? Nice. Uh, jump H, nice. jump H. Snipe him out of the air. Now, first round goes to Logic. <laughs> okay. I, I think he expected the uh, SSM. Yeah, interesting though, because I don't know if he was, you know, just smashing. It's like, oh, SSM is coming, or yeah. if he reacted to the standing M and thought that the WFT was there. Yeah, but, but now Snake and without Rage, this looks a little bit tough for him, mm -hmm. especially when he has to win two rounds. And Logic chilling on that Rage. Oof, okay. Oof. We still got Konru. Oh, nice! Oof! Rage. Rage Ice Spirit. See, on, on the hard knockdown uh, Tondeke, 
you could have activated and played the cross up game with Eason. <laughs> <laughs> I think he wants to sa save his rage up for the potentially last round. Fair enough. Yeah, that's Ooh, gonna be it. Yes, that's gonna be it. Uh, so Snake is still alive. Mm -hmm. But look at that rage from Logic. Yeah, full rage bar, and uh, it can be right after the depletion. You could go into rage explosion and still have, you know, a rage bar to you. Yeah. He also advantage. can because he also can grab um, a snake and freely because he can't burst out of it. So <laughs> grab That's into cool. weapon flipping and dipping is an option. <sighs> nice. Ooh, that was nice. And the jumping H to prevent the jump. Like, look, why aren't you bursting? <laughs> like, look. At Okay. No, nice. now, now this this looks grim for Snake and no weapon. Still the life lead gets the weapon back and snipes logic out of the air without burst. No I, rage explosion. <laughs> and the uh, two one for uh, Snake and showing yeah, Snake us the Sam show patience. Those jumping age have been uh, really key into this uh, uh, clash, into this matchup. Sniping mm -hmm. uh, the opponents out of the air, whether it was uh, just a free jump or getting people, uh, getting them out of the platform jump, mm -hmm. uh, that's a lot of damage. You know, jumping age are a lot of damage in some yeah. people, So they will start counting. They will start uh, start having their weight in the in the match. So very good. Yeah, well, it, very nice play from both from both of them, and mm -hmm. uh, we're gonna have the next match, and I believe it's gonna be uh, Kusa fourteen versus uh, TB. Yeah, Kusa uh, usually using the Gendro, and on the other side also TB use usually using the Gendro. But both characters, mm -hmm. uh, both players have uh, other characters. Both Kusa and TB, I think, have a Hanzo. <laughs> <laughs> Which is, you know, strange enough, you know, uh, two two different players using yeah. two characters that are the same, and uh, yeah, we'll see who will come into play. You know, Genjiro against Genjiro. If one of them pick uh, pick Kanzo, both of them pick Kanzo, or they're gonna pick some other character. Yeah, oh. and also, and also, we have um, uh, to remind yourself that uh, Kusa got sponsored um, uh, like a few days ago, I think, you know, from uh, Rise Gaming. So, congratulations on that, Kusa. Congratulations on the pickup. We'll, mm -hmm. uh, we hope that you know soon the the offline uh, scene will be starting, and it will be like it would be nice to see him compete around the uh, tournaments for the game. Yeah. So I think it's also a great pick because he's one of the best in EU, so... Oh, Gong Sun Lee's coming to play. Mm. So we'll see Umbrella's flying around the screen. Now, mm. she's a new character, and I think a lot of people get bamboozled by her options. Mm -hmm. But if you have experience and you know that you block the Umbrella, I don't think the Umbrella retains any hitbox while, you know, that the player is not interacting with it, right? So I've seen a lot of people get scammed by blocking the umbrella and then Gong Su Lee just kind of teleporting and throwing them. It's like, uh, you got you to be ready for it. Yeah, like, see, it's not hurting you. So at that point, if you're standing behind the umbrella, just wait for the teleport to punish. That should be like number one priority against this character. Yeah, that's a nice color for, for Gong Su Lee. Yeah, I'm liking the umbrella as well. Yeah. Oof. Both with blue characters, actually. Ooh, okay. Nice teleport. So, uh, over the fireball. Yeah, this That's is what good. I do with the Kudomaru in Garu. So if they <laughs> fireball the screen, you punish them. Very good. Oh, nice guy. Keeps him in the corner. Mm -hmm. She goes away. Back into the corner we go. Oh, didn't connect. Yeah, maybe he didn't know the animation. He wasn't ready for that punish. But now full stocks with the uh, with the fireball. So, oof, <laughs> grab, sweep. That's for breakfast. Oh, gets him with the cross up. You can dodge it. What yeah. happened there? Okay, he, like press something in the block string and got like obliterated by the damage. Maybe. Yeah. It, looked, it looked like it. 
Ooh, well, that's a weapon flipping and dipping. So no weapons it? for Hanzo. Okay, still has the fireballs though. Yeah, and with the with the rage, that's a big. Mm, that's a big no no. Yeah, yeah. And also, like right now, it should be ready for the teleport because if she can teleport. Ooh, Ooh nice play catch. What? What? Yes, yes, you can activate SSM uh, with uh, with the displays, basically umbrella. So you gotta be that's ready for that. <laughs> you can like that's why I, that's why I said to react to the teleport. I didn't say just press a button when you're expecting the teleport. Yeah. Because that happened. That was nicely played. Ready, yes, you can react to the animation. So one zero for Kusa, with the new character Gonson Lee. Uh, yeah. It doesn't surprise me that Kusa um, uh, tries out new characters. <laughs> he always does. Mm. We'll see. We'll see later. Let's see if his I mean, character locked or not. I don't know. If his character locked, it is locking himself. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> <laughs> nobody's asking him to damn the damage. Okay, lands on the fireball. No 6 6 c cross up from there on the on the knockdown. See on the knockdown it's pretty good to go for a 6 6 c front or back because you don't have the, the time to actually spot dodge since spot dodge is start up. That's true. And full stocks of fireballs. Mm -hmm. Not anymore. I jinxed it. <sighs> okay. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, maybe maybe because I wasn't uh wasn't like didn't know where it would land. And he mm. got surprised by the landing. This is quite of a slow one. Also, the recovery after uh, Hanzo shoots his um, uh, kunai or shuriken is really, really uh, fast. So, mm. oof, it's soon. Okay. Big damage. One more could actually kill if he stays in rage. Oh, mm. never mind. <laughs> he poorly timed his fireballs and got hit by the butterfly fireball. Looks like a butterfly. <laughs> Looks like a swallow to me. Swallow? Mm -hmm. Damn, the anti air with the umbrella <laughs> off screen. It's raining console. Double teleport into nothing. Interesting interaction. Oh, nice. Challenge right away, though, with a crush D. Interesting decision. In this yeah. case, I think Anzo wins the fireball. When he's on rage. Yeah, definitely when <laughs> when the rage is activated. That's the punish. And now TB's in the corner. <laughs> oh! oh it's the standing A, but she recovers too fast. Doesn't get the juggle, interestingly. Ah, big punish. Let's see with the cross up. See? No? Nice, oh, nice, nice starting to blow back there. Since there's a lot of active frames, since it's like seven or eight, eight hits, to actually parry is uh, easier in that situation, so smart to avoid the jump in by parrying. Nice, uh, nice punish on the teleport as well. Yeah, they couldn't uh, surprise Kusa with the, um, um, uh, with the overhead, and Kung Su Lee advances in the bracket. Yeah, two zero, very convincing here. And uh, mm -hmm. TB looked a little bit lost uh, with their options. Uh, I don't know how many, you know, people play Gonzo Lee right now online. Uh, mm -hmm. So it might not be that easy to get uh, meaningful practice and so on. So yeah. definitely. Uh, uh, not uh, easy. Mm -hmm. I also had the feeling that uh, TB didn't know uh, what to do in this matchup. So, but it's I think it's uh, it's a valid point because uh, she she's new. You know, so don't be too disappointed in TB. He still play, um, uh, played really well. Yeah, absolutely. And um, we remind you guys that yeah. we have a match arena that you can uh, donate to. Um, you can also do the sponsor quest on the right. We are going to pay the top three past thirty dollars. So let's uh, <coughs> let's help if you haven't done it yet to get the list there. Maybe we can get it. 100 if people uh, work on it and uh, then we played we, we we would pay the top eight it's quite mm -hmm. nice reward for your work when 
you know, even if it's just online, it still keeps you competitive, which is what we need as fighting game players. Yeah, that's true. And we uh, and we are at uh, sixteen dollars, I see. So, mm -hmm. it's which is nice, which is nice. Man. It could, could be a little bit more, you know. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing, I, I'm doing my sponsor quest right now. <laughs> just <laughs> like I'm so. Yeah. You like can also me. you can also get some uh, some some nice beats from uh, from get some right. I got mine, which is uh, Cof uh, 14 Vice. She looks pretty <laughs> cool. The girl. Yeah, it's my girl, my boo boo. <laughs> mm. So okay, we have, so I, I think we have some problems with uh, Sunny Boy because the next match we're gonna, it's gonna be uh, Fraza versus uh, Sunny Boy. Sunny Boy, who is uh, actually a newcomer in in, uh, in this um, in this tournament, so it's the first time he participates, and uh, he's from Germany, I think. And I think he has some troubles to get into the lobby, so we have to solve this technical issue. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're yeah. trying. Fortunately, like it's not under. Our power to fix this, but hopefully we'll see. Yeah, that's yeah. also true. We know, we know that Fraser is uh, a very good Samsung player, but also he destroys lobbies. No? So <laughs> I don't know if it's not one thing that happens. I don't know if he if it's his fault, but <laughs> it's every time, you know, it's every time when Fraser, <laughs> he's gonna kill me for that. Yeah, mm -hmm. he has he has to find me first. That's true. I mean, Luxembourg is that big, you know. Yeah, he doesn't have a pillar to help him. <laughs> yeah. So Chaco, don't help him. Don't don't give him your pillar. Mm -hmm. Ah, so. How maru? Oh, there you know. So how maru? Germans like yeah, to play how maru. <laughs> Germans oh. being uh, Germans being him and illusion. <laughs> yeah, there was there was another another guy who played uh, Homaru, but um, oh. I I, th I think he didn't uh, participate in uh, Sunday Showdown. But uh, the time when I was in in Cologne, it's it, it's it's such a German thing, you know. They always play. Um, they always pick the um, uh, beach stage in Windjammer, so, so they always <sighs> the play with the bumpers, man. <laughs> also, my friend Bayer is in the back. Mm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Your favorite okay. character. Nice, con nice conversion there into the DP to take uh, yeah. round one against that was Fraser. Nice, yeah, it was really convincing from uh, from Sunny Boy, and also Fraser also played um, uh, a bit uh, of Kong Sun Lee also last time. So yeah, it was nice. The bear is looking. Bear's like, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> also, like I like that uh, uh, Sunny Boy is. Defending on the fireballs, building his rage mm -hmm. meter. The yeah, process. that's what you should do. If people are throwing my fireballs at you, just defend. Don't just defend. Don't. Oh, you have to just defend, but don't just defend. <laughs> Workplace. Joke master Rod. Yeah. You guys. <laughs> Linguistic teacher. Yay. Okay, mm -hmm. big, uh, big knockdown in the corner right now. So, ooh, get out of the corner though. Tamara, ooh! Try to go for the... Not yeah. that sneaky overhead. <laughs> this is like a, <laughs> plane, uh, a bit slow overhead, but sure. <laughs> it's, 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 it's the sloppiest overhead ever, but it's no one. <laughs> Tamara style, so... That's why I prefer Ukyo. Nice. It's more calculated. Uh, there, there. Gets out. Oh. Ready for the punish. Mm, but nine Indeed. seconds left, so Sunny Boy has to do something like this. Oof. Damn. Press the button right after. Yep. You don't expect people, you know, to eat the button when they've eaten like a 35% heavy in the face. <laughs> but, you know, Fredzo was like, okay, you might want to go in. I'll challenge you. Oh, block all the way. Fresh and as you can see now, Son uh, Sunny Boy has a lot of rage meter, like constantly, because of the parries. Oof, but now he bursted. A little bit too early, perhaps. For my taste. <laughs> okay. Gone now. Our will be back. Okay. 
So no big damage, even though Heavy Slash does a lot of damage, and we still got the SSM. But yeah. Haumaru's SSM not the greatest. Nice, nice. Keep away from Freza, doesn't let uh, Sunnybo get in. Yeah, a bit too but many. Puts him, the song, yeah, puts him in the corner, but gets out. Yeah, that's really tricky. And we see that Sunny Boy is um, uh, running after Gong Sung Lee. That's uh, her nasty game plan. And the clock is ticking. Mm -hmm. Coco, yo! Oof! The big, the big C. <laughs> and now he bursts and, yeah, putting... Pri oh! That's a sign! No! Or the just Should have the SSM. That was nicely done! Okay, still, still like not over. Anything can happen. Jump so the fireball. Oh, scary. oh, with the S ten. Ooh, that that that, 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 that looked like a bit slap fireball though. Like, six six D with the long recovery, very easy to punish him. Yeah. Uh, should have done the SSM, Sunny boy. You would have gotten the game. <laughs> Sometimes it happens, like, I think a lot of people in this game are not ready for yeah. the, the chance to land SSM. They don't believe, you know, when they get whatever, like, they block a DP or they bait something. They, they're ready for the bait, but they're not ready for the follow-up for whatever reason. Yeah, and I yeah. Think the game is very nerve-heavy. Uh, yeah, so that's you, true. Get to, you get to flinch a lot. You get to have that yeah. problem, basically, with that. You, um, uh, you will have this uh, oh, oh, moment. <laughs> oh, it worked. Uh, what should I do now? Mm. That's me actually playing the game. Mm. And when it works, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm gonna be like, oh, it's okay. But that was calculated, of course. <laughs> okay, instantly put in the corner to, to deal with the, the fireball and the umbrella. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna teleport. Oh, nice. Oh, too late. On the big damage. I'm honestly wondering, like, how Omaru kind of deals with this matchup because it's a lot of zoning and it doesn't have the best ways to get in. Mm, that's true. I think he. Like, can, you yeah. deflect, can you even deflect the umbrella if she throws it at you? I don't think so. I don't think uh, Ukyo can. Yeah. But, like, she teleports to the umbrella when, you know, it's like that. So he has to be on the floor, I guess. <laughs> Tried this to is, yeah. the game, but doesn't get it, unfortunately. Mm, this is looking very frustrating for Sunny Boy. Oh, okay. nice. Uh, we can get some offense going on. Mm, that's true. But she can just teleport away. I think he. Like, yeah, she's a scary cat. Can you even deflect the scary, she she scary bunny. <laughs> I don't think so. Angst I don't so think they, they, uh, they, uh, they say that in um, uh, German. Big whiff, yeah, and that's gonna be it. Uh, first round goes to Fredzer. Still lost a lot of life, so it's, it's possible, Sonny Boy. You can do it. Ooh, okay, block it, block it. Yeah, punish, punish. No! 660 six or 60, 66C, six, six but oh my god. That's such a such a big chance lost. Yeah. Let's see how it goes. Okay. Oh. She can teleport out of that corner, yes. See, you gotta be ready for that too. That's yeah. the, like, the way of like, that's the lateral thinking that you need to have. Yeah. Because you could have done standing M and then buffer the DP and react it on the other side. To the that's deal. true. Ooh, nice but back dash, but just avoids the grab. Doesn't get the punish. Nope. Oh. Yeah, this, this looks rough if you don't stop and think of the possibilities and you just kind of like chase her because you're frustrated. This looks mm -hmm. really rough. Yeah, and that was a nicely displayed by uh, Fraser, who doesn't let Sonny Boy get in and uh, wins the second match. Hello, Romans. No, this is not uh, Parsec. This is PS4 Netplay. Yeah. So, is it break time? Okay, so we're gonna have a break, guys. Mm -hmm. Of five minutes as usual. Meanwhile, check the match arena and uh, contribute to the prize pot. Yeah, see you right back.
And we are back with uh, Sunday Showdown 12, uh, the biggest European uh, uh, Samurai Showdown monthly tournament. And uh, we should be going into our next match soon. As usual, uh, coming back from the break, remember to check the Maturino guys. And uh, mm -hmm. you can check also the bracket, I believe, with the uh, bracket command. Do we have a bracket command in the chat today? Otherwise, uh, I think uh, some, some of the viewers. Yeah, yeah they always is. Yeah, viewers would be, you know, fast to just provide the bracket, guys, so you can see who is playing today. We have seen some uh, Gong Sun Lee. We have seen uh, some uh, Rimururu. We have seen some uh, Pillars. So we have a good variety of, uh, you know, characters as well. Yeah, I also had an Hanzo and then Haomaru. Mm -hmm. So I still miss so Nukyo. Okay, okay, so uh, our next match should be uh, Kusa 14 versus Instinct, but uh, again, there are some. I think you need to invite Grim uh, or add Grimlers on PSN, which is, a, which is a shame because it's it's written in the rules and in the check in that we do on this console. <laughs> Imagine it's important. the other <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, uh, that was who was that? I think I think it was in the Kof tournament. We uh, a lot of people because they didn't read the the rules. So and 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 and, and we are strict, you know. <laughs> so we yeah, to be honest, like to be honest, like the FGC at large could uh, use some strictness when it comes to that. I've had my own experiences with running tournaments and people not reading the rules and asking like silly questions. Let's just say that. Uh, so yeah. People read the rules if you enter tournaments or don't enter tournaments. <laughs> it's like, yeah. you know what I mean? It's that easy. Yeah, um, so, yeah, mm -hmm. so uh, do we have? No, it's still not, still not in. But it's, yeah. I, I, I think it's normal. We also have in Luxembourg some some people who uh, we, um, uh, we, um, uh, we do um, uh, post like, oh, today we have a Tekken tournament, Tekken, 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 Tekken. And then uh, some guy um, shows up and says, uh, what tournament um, are we doing tonight? <sighs> <laughs> Classic. Tekken. You see that flyer over there? Tekken. Yeah. Yeah, I know, I know. Classic, uh, <clears throat> classic FGC, unfortunately. Yeah. I wonder if I suppose I will stick with uh, Gong Sun Lee until the end or not. I think he will. Because he has this habit of like <laughs> hard locking himself into characters for no reason whatsoever. <laughs> I think it's, uh, it's also great, um, uh, a great thing to do because some some people just want to learn a, a new character, and that's what you have to do when you want, when you want to learn a new character. Just stick to uh, to, the, uh, to to the new character, you know. It's uh, something that Alexei does also when uh, when Mina came out. He um, uh, played a lot of Mina, uh, so just to learn to, to learn the match, even though it's 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 harder to play with a new character because you're more used to with the with the old character. Yeah. You know, hopefully, to, hopefully, Genan comes out and I can get our retirement and uh, <laughs> blades, leak that blood of the blades. Yeah, it that's true. <laughs> <laughs> More figuratively and literally as a demon. <laughs> oh my, that evil, that evil green dude. <laughs> I like him because he can play kind of like. But he can also mm. play quite aggressive, uh, especially if they'll keep the um, the slides, uh, the down Ds uh, from uh, Samurai Showdown 2. It would actually have like one of the few uh, normals that was like constantly plus and in your face. <laughs> it was kind of a fun yeah. character in Samurai Showdown 2. I really okay. miss him. I, I, I only played uh, Samurai Showdown 5, so. I actually don't know uh, much about Ganon. He's, a, he's, a, he's an annoying character for sure. He's an annoying character. Yeah, like I mean, you the... play. He must be annoying. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he has the zoning with the with the poison breath. He has a, okay. a, a rope on his cord, so he can kind of like pull you in from full screen for whatever reason you whiff something. He can pull you in from full screen and full combo you. He can anti you with um, a rolling thing kind of like blank but with blades um what else he has oh he also is a ninja so he used to have the the whole you know log or explosion kind of substitution thing uh, 
and he has incredible anti-airs. Oh no. So like it could it be one like of problem. the characters in this game. It could be one of the characters in this game that anti-airs will like no problems at all. Which is something that, you know, in the in, in Samurai Showdown 7 is a problem. Like the jumping seas are a problem in this game. So I would welcome him and just kinda teach people not to jump on me. Mm. So we still have no uh, instant oh, joining. Are. Well, somebody joined. I don't know if he's okay. Stick. Okay, yeah. okay. I, I, I can't see him for, for some reason. I'm okay, but now I see him. Now I can see him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so uh, he, he got in. He got in finally, so... But again, but again, I I hear the the big man saying he's lucky because he doesn't like to wait. <laughs> the big man in the shadows. So it's we got a Yashima. Yashima. Okay. Ah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, 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 I think um, Alexin told me um, Instinct is the one that uh, that I uh, also met in uh, uh, in Ufa, I think. And okay. uh, I played some sets with him uh, against his Yashima. He's pretty great. So. I'm really looking forward to this match. Yeah, Yashamar is a character that has a lot, in my opinion. Like, you really need to mm -hmm. be smart with his movement to create opportunities because it's not a character that has very annoying options, in my opinion. Yeah, it's pretty technical, I would say. So you can't do things just to do things. Uh, but... Uh, he has a re. Oof. So, Kusa sticking with Kong Sung Lee. Grab. Really tricky right now using teleports. Oh, that uh, Gong Sung Lee theme is really cool. <laughs> okay, so the umbrella is on top of him, so the teleport yeah. will come and is getting zoned out with the fireballs. One one solution could be a 45 degree dive because if she teleports, she gets clipped by the startup, and if she doesn't and she fireballs, she hits it in the face. So yeah, that's true. Yeah, Oof. I just oh. just completely uh, misplaced the height. Yeah, and puts him something in, in the corner, and uh, Kusa is uh, going on with pressure. Mm -hmm. Ooh, but oh. where? Now instinct has to do a lot of things to get back. And no, jump kick does it. First round. Yeah, unfortunately, unfortunately, put himself. He put himself in a terrible position with that die, but just misplacing the height. Yeah. <coughs> also, see that we could have died, dived there. See in. Uh... Uh, what's it called? In Samurai Showdown, a lot of people don't deal with uh, uh, fireball spam with a spot dodge in place. I don't know why. It, fe it feels like the, the, the option doesn't exist. People forget about it. Because uh, if you're spot dodging, like you can either parry and you know leech meter off of it, or just mm -hmm. spot dodge and force the opponent to come in, in a way or another. Yeah, but yeah, okay. Um, especially when fireballs are really um, uh, fast, you know. But maybe people don't um, uh, don't want to um, uh, spot dodge because you can change um, the speed of the fireballs, you know. Yeah, so... but then you can react when it's coming to you. You know what I mean? Yeah, you that's true. React start up. Yeah, that's true. Oh, nice! He gets the second round. Yeah. So the medium does it. <laughs> Patience. Patience against Kung Fu Lee. Oof! Now she dives in. <laughs> Again, the umbrella is in the air, so be careful. I think Kusa was expecting the dive here. Double jumps. Nice. nice. Smart to come back to its original place and snipe her out of the wrong uh, throw. Ooh, nice damage. Oh! A little bit too late, otherwise... Oof! Nice anti-air. I like... I, I really like the patient of Instinct. He's, he's just staying there. Mm -hmm. but jumping back, you know, it doesn't... Um, uh, doesn't want to play Kong Sung Lee's um, uh, game plan, you know? It's anti-air with a close C. And some more damage. 
Oh, nice. Nice die. Ooh. And they are practically even. Little life lead for, for Kusa in this case, but now both on red. Yashamaru Ooh, with what? it. That's it? Yes. And first Didn't game have the time to rage burst. First game goes to instinct. Yeah. That's a nice surprise. Hmm. And again, the patience paid off. So that um, Yashamaru can really also an m m annoy people by German just jumping back, staying in his place. Okay. Movement is really important. Like people mm -hmm. simply underestimate the, the power of movement. You can confuse, mm -hmm. people, you can bait them, you can uh, force them. Like if he was to, you know, once again spot dodge every single fireball, he would force her to come in. Yeah, Especially if yeah. that was a nice dive. Okay. Nice jump a jump H. Yeah, Fred. Uh, what's it called? Kusa is jumping a little bit too okay. much. And uh, yeah, sorry. They both use constantly. But yeah, Kusa yeah. is jumping a bit too much, and you don't want to challenge the air option. Yes, because that's yeah. like literally the best thing he has. In the the character kind of works around that the air movement and the air options he has. At the moment, keeping him uh, away from the, uh, the weapon manages to get it now. Oh, nice. Oh, that's a nice. And one run away for actually, from actually beating uh, Kusa in uh, in this tournament. So yeah. keeping an eye on this Yashimaru. Another thing is the WFT is there, and WFT is basically a flurry of fireballs. That's mm. another option they could use against uh, the fireball zone. Because worst case scenario is safe unless she has the umbrella behind you. Yeah. And now he's in the corner. Ooh. Doesn't get the punish, gets grabbed. Yeah, no looking. Oh, right big life, yeah, big life lead for Kusa in them uh, in this round. Oh, nice, nice teleporting to grab. To get some more of them damage chunks. Yeah, I think uh, right now Instinct is fishing way too hard for hair to airs. So even in situations where he could grab, is jumping over his opponent, hoping that they will jump and he gets a big reward with the H's. And that's fishing a little bit too hard. Yeah, so that was an ooh! Ooh, that was a hard weed! Too risky. Yeah, now you're in the corner. Ooh, can I punish that? Oh, he wants to. I saw yeah, that. I, I saw that. <laughs> the blade catch. Ooh, nice anti air with the jab. Jumps back. Nice teleports. Um, uh, teleports really benefit uh, Kusa in this one. Ooh, Ooh. Finds, uh, finds the punish. Gets sniped. It's the way of the cross. <laughs> crow, right? Is it the crow? I, I think. <laughs> I think. Forgive my bad Japanese. Even though next week I start lessons in Japanese. Yay! Yay! Meanwhile, oh, this game oh, don't. Yes. The, ult the ultimate weep. <gasps> oh, mm. What a spot dodge! What a spot dodge! Oh, that was that was risky, <laughs> but very nicely done from uh, from Kusa. He read the uh, the Eason and uh, dodged it completely. Yeah, Gong Sun Lee said, I'm a girl from the high society. Don't you dare lay your fingers on me. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, no. I'm a Ojo Sama. Bunny Ojo Sama. Usagi Ojo Sama. <laughs> Is it the crow? I think. Oof. We'll get okay. the full punish. Nice. Forgive my bad Japanese. 40% well no, okay. done. Yeah. Oh, don't. Yes, knife. Oh, Ooh, this one. Oh, and another one. one yeah. One, one for she can actually take it from him. That was. Yeah, also, yeah, build your meter. Use your, use your uh, WFT. No, no big fan. Oh my god! Ah, oh, this. <gasps> this is pretty intense. Now he's looking for um, what's it called? A blade, uh, a blade throw. Let's check it out. Ooh, another oh, another. Still, still not enough damage, and always the air to air from Kusa. They always hit and, and find the jumping light. That was nicely done. So both players pretty evenly matched. Oof. Oof. Nice, very smart to to just land and block and then punish the the blowback. 
blowback tick from startup, so that's something you can do for the game. Oh no, it doesn't get the whole the, the, the full punish. There it is. Okay, yeah, but nice, but they're very smart. Oh, oh nice. Risky, but pays off. Okay, he just has to chill now. The big the damage is insane if he gets hit. Mm, it also really really hard. Mm. Oh, oh, the and now he has to now he should pop. Now he should pop it just like you know, throw, like wait for the WFT chance to just kind of delete the fireball and or, or just chip damage. Or maybe he wants to keep it for the third third round just in case. This could so still play. like he, although he has a big advantage. He's he's losing a lot of life right now though. Kusa mm -hmm. playing playing the keep away game. I would wait to. Oh, he wants to burst. He wants okay. to win this round. He wants to win this round. Okay. Oh, the dive got him. Insect. I think. I think. Uh, um, Kusa there tried to backdash, and Maybe. the dive punished the recovery of it. Yeah. Yeah. It was a nice down from Instinct, and we see Instinct um, advancing. So this is top eight, I think. So he's advancing to uh, winners finals, I think. Yeah, imagine entering your first Sunday showdown. You take out Kusa, you send into losers. Yeah. Like, that's a good, you know, business card. It's like, oh, here, here it is. I am instinct. Not only I play a character that nobody plays, I also take your reigning champion and send him into losers. Yeah, <laughs> you some experience. Yeah. Very good. That's true, but fair enough. Kusa didn't play his main character, you know. But true that. True but that. but we know how how good of a player uh, Kusa is. So. Nonetheless, uh, Instinct should be proud of himself. Absolutely, absolutely. Very good, uh, very good player. Uh, usually dominates whatever character he picks, really. He's always in the yeah. top three. So, uh, nice change today. We'll see uh, how the loser run uh, goes for, uh, uh, for Kusa. So, so, next match. Next match, I think it should be Madonna's Lamu versus uh, Fresa, which is the classic. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> it's yes. also like the, the, the matching. Uh, you know, the like Johnny Lobby classic, so we'll see how that yeah. goes. So the the worst match of oh, I see Marco Polo in, in, in the stream. Shout out to Marco Polo for commentating oh, yeah. of R on the Friday. So, so, nice to nice that you're watching us. Yeah, yeah, it was really nice. Have you seen the big upset or that you just like literally missed it? No, you were there for the big upset. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I was, I was, I was there. And uh, yeah, so the biggest the worst matchup for Maidonos Lamu and Fraser is the lobby system. Yeah, exactly. Lobby system wins 9-1, uh, nine, 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 I would say. It's yeah, 9-1. Nine, nine, one. It's not a 10-0, but sometimes nah. they actually make it, but it's a hard matchup. <laughs> sometimes uh, it's... Yeah. I see also Clorox PR. Hello. Hello, guys in the chat. I was... Uh, I, want... These pros. <laughs> I wanted uh, for a second to go back to Instinct and uh, is user is yeah, yeah. of Yasumaru. Funny enough, I haven't seen much of the WFT being used. You were thinking that match would be, you know, a choice that he would go for uh, because he, he, he manages to challenge the, the option of both the the fireball and the the, the umbrella. Fair enough, is not the biggest. It, sorry, the, the fastest fireball cast, so to speak. But it covers yeah. a lot of the screen. And once again, if the if the umbrella is not behind you. She can't really punish you for it. So yeah, it's also free, free, free chip. Oh, yeah, it's also free chip damage. So uh, he has to also think of that as an option. Uh, mm -hmm. And I really like his patience. Also, it was also the same when I played him in, in, in Ufa. So really annoying, especially for my Ukyo. Mm -hmm. so like yeah. to no. So we have to remake this lobby. I'm, uh, I heard. Yeah. Okay, so we again have uh, the problem, so I'm going to leave mm -hmm. and wait for the new invitation. Now, now I imagine like a uh, King of Fighters invitation, but instead of an R, we have a G for Grimalus. <laughs> I wouldn't say I wouldn't say the um, WFT is useless. It's certainly not an instant reward, but it's something that passively is there. And even if it's just for the cheap, it's still something. You know what I mean? When you get the normal ra um, rage meter, like not when you burst, but when you just get rage, you can just spam it, and they have mm -hmm. to deal with it. So if you're 
WFT doesn't exactly combo, that's that's the way that you should use it. Yeah, thank you. I've I've uh, accepted. I accepted the invite. So, just a oh. moment, chop tomate. <laughs> I'm, 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 <laughs> I'm getting. Un attimo. Un attimo. <laughs> Un attimo. <laughs> per favore, watch only. <laughs> Voglio solo guardare, non... Uh, non voglio combattere. When I was, uh, when I was young, when I was young, I always said um, uh, combattere instead of uh, giocare. Combattere means fight instead of play, you know? <laughs> I, d I didn't play games, I fought games. Okay, they can start, so we see... Oh, oh. Madonna and Fraser, so a 9-1 matchup, uh, I, I told you. So, uh, I don't, yeah, Gorilla. it should be Kong Sung Lee against, uh, <laughs> hmm. yeah, he said it. So, I don't know who's on which side because I see SNK Ghost. <laughs> okay, we'll see once it starts. Against SNK Ghost, yeah, we see that. I see that. I have SNK Ghost, Hauma Rovers, Hauma. No, no, we got, uh, we got Genjuro. So, I think Fraser is the Genjuro, yeah. And, uh, my, yeah, yeah and my, my Donos Lamu, he plays also Gong Suli because she has an umbrella and he likes umbrellas. <laughs> umbrella yeah. gang, right? Oh. Umbrella Academy. <laughs> <laughs> Get the age though. Ooh, kicks. It was like, look at my slippers. <laughs> Genjiro with the sandals. Yeah. And the socks. A bit German. Yeah, a bit German. <laughs> <laughs> but it's in Japan, so it's okay. It's not for for for, for vacation. Yeah. It's to fight for honor. So as you can see, Fraser is padding uh, the fireballs to try and get the rage mm -hmm. meter. Ooh, big Ooh, he's Ooh. Ooh. He's too fast. Yeah, he mistimed it. Yeah. Teleports into the. Oh, nice, nice blowback. Ooh, bit. And this what a, what a snipe. That was a nice anti air. And now Genjiro has to take his weapon. And nope. I think he's gonna wait for the next round to take yeah. his weapon. <laughs> <laughs> was not was my weapon. Was trying to get the <laughs> nice blowback. After back. round they just tossed the weapon to go back to their opponents. Ooh, this should be it. Ooh, what a, what a snipe. Very smart. He that used the nice. the yeah. was a light, the second one was most likely a heavy to get to the take his weapon that. back, mm. and nope, very Five tricky to block that. Ooh, gets okay. the knockdown. <laughs> the sweep. <laughs> oh, nice, that's nice damage. Oh, oh this no. is yeah. just slightly too far. Yeah, that was a nice idea though. Mm -hmm. He bursts. Yeah, now I can take the fireballs away, you see? Ooh. Yeah. Oof! Yeah. Nine, okay. he didn't want to flip it. And now he does it. This doesn't do a lot of damage, but still... Kong Sui doesn't have a, a, a weapon. Can she do... can she do SSM? When she doesn't have the weapon? I don't think so. so I, I think the Umbrella has to be active, you know? Mm -hmm. But yeah, right now my Donna Slamu with the full rage and uh, yeah, yeah, and so yeah. Just right off the bat, it's like you know yeah. what, let's not lose any time. Let's disarm my opponent and then play yeah. the Atlantic game from this, there. And then this looks really grim for for our boy Fraser. Now you're away from the sword. Yeah, and this uh, uh, teleport to it. Yeah, yeah. exactly. So this and looks like he doesn't open the stage, which is which is annoying because if the umbrella is on the other side. You'd expect her to be on the sword, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. That would be a bit too broken, I guess. Oof. But now, Fraser has to play Tekken. <laughs> yes. And win this. The King of Iron Fist tournament. Genjuro, next DLC character for Season 4. Why not? Yeah, Without sword. Not this looks still a little painful, yes. Also, oh, yes. Made nice control. Very good to leave the sword on the other side. Yeah. 
some people say it's lame, but no, <laughs> it's very effective. <laughs> So 1-0 for Madonna Zlamu with a, a nice Gong Sung Lee. Mm -hmm. So we have three. We had, we had three Gong Sung Lee's um, in, this, in this tournament, so... Yeah, Frenza doesn't want to match the Gong Sung Lee for whatever reason. It's sticking to yeah. the Maybe he does like the mirror match? Mm -hmm. I'm thinking that Tam Tam actually has some options against Gong Sung Lee, if you think yeah. about it. He has the, the skulls under and over the earth fireball. He has the spit and he has the SSM to jump over the fireball. Plus, you know, the reach that he has. <laughs> so the second match started. Ooh, there was a nice jump in from Freza. Doesn't get the whole punish though. On the umbrella because he knows that yeah exactly the teleport can happen but got not one. Mm, that was too late. Still, oh, he gets nice DP. control and huge damage in the corner plus a hard knockdown. Very smart to blow back. Yeah. They are oh, no. That was, that was too far away. Oh, across up. Punish. This is one tactic. Yeah, and now there's a lot of options for uh, Fraser to close the game. 660. Oh, that, oh that's was a nicely timed job. And just like that, Fraser gets the first round. It looks pretty convincingly to me. Oof. He has been a little bit more aggressive, more wary mm -hmm. of his time, from punishes and so on. Still, he has the weapon flipping, not anymore. Nice poking though from uh, Madonna's Lamu and uh, Freza is already at 50%. Okay. Why does he go for the throw? Because like, he's trying to really time uh, the, the grounded thing because he wants a grounded damage, right? Was it was it SSM? Maybe. Which would be odd because I don't think you have enough time to do an SSM after that. Oof! Jump! Nice, nice drop. I understand yeah. the show is achievable, so anything that uh, Maidonis would have done, if he hadn't done the DP, would have killed him, so might as well go for it. Yeah, yeah, that was a nice um, uh, decision, but alas, it didn't hit. Yeah, her run speed is also like so fast, look at that. Yeah, yeah, uh, it's... you know how, how fast bunnies are. Yeah, fair enough. A bunny in a, in a field. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she, has the, she has the environment advantage too. <laughs> Even though it's casual stage. Yeah, exactly. Ooh, nice. Doesn't continue the Rekkas, because once they are blocked, they are really punchable. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sure. Can punch with SSM. And there's also gaps between them, so it's not even like blocking yeah. them. You can punish before blocking them. Yeah, that's true. Oof, nice. Ah, grab. Far away. Again, not enough life. Oh, he went for the SSM without bursting, though. Was that a. Is, is the SSM. Is there a SSM uh, a common grab? Because I haven't seen her yet. Because it looked know. like there was no, like, hit or whatever. It looked like a common grab. Oh, okay, fair enough. Yeah, it's, it's where the umbrella is, but I don't know if it's a hit or a grab. I actually don't know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, fair enough. Yeah, the common grab. She makes her umbrella explode. Okay, fair ah, enough. Ah, okay. So, 1-1. One, 1-1. One. One, one. No, nice matches. Yeah, nice Two adjustment, uh, nice adjustment uh, from... Uh, <coughs> from Fraser, uh, yeah. Fraser, yeah. It was a bit more aggressive, it was a bit more like pressure base. There was not much distance uh, at most times between him and Gong Sun Li, so I understand what he's trying to do and it's working out. Yeah, so, and uh, my Donald Lamu uh, sticks with uh, Gong Sun Li. We know he has a uh, nice uh, Shizumaru and also Rimoruru. 
Mm -hmm. I prefer to stay with the burn. What a backdash! Of the end of the active frames of the Rekka. I just like that. Guys. Yeah, right now they're just kind of starting each other. Uh, I mm. think Reza is trying to find the, the, the right timing and spacing to jump over Fireball. Mm -hmm. Not the time Madonna's is like, or okay, what do I do to keep him away? Yeah, and once she has knockdown, he can uh, commence his offense. Mm. Can't he combo from the standing D into Rekka's? There's a big like time. Mm -hmm. There's a lot to confirm there. Nice air to air. Oh, Ooh, nice. Madonna's Lamu read the jump, uh, read the grab, jumped over it, and punished properly. Mm. And still with a little bit of rage, and as I say it, it disappears. Spots. <laughs> and both players just poking each other out. But Madonna's Lamu is oh, nice. Oh, the jumping C on the extended hurt box of the umbrella. Press is doing a great job to keeping in the in in the in the corner. Yeah, 50, 70 percent, 80 percent already gone. Yeah. And now you don't want to use the rage meter either. You know, on both sides, it's like yeah, just give it for the third match unless it's absolutely necessary. Now Fraser is chilling. Yeah, he knows that like the time is on his side, and he can just yeah. kind of there finds the oh, jumping nice. him though at uh, <clears throat> medium range and gets round two. Both of them with the rage explosion still available. Uh, Freds are not far from the actual rage, so it might just block. Yeah, exactly. Just just defend those fireballs oh. and get the rage. It look weird, but it's okay. Okay. Now he has rage. Just fast the rage. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And it's gone. Okay. Ooh, nice time jump in. And again, Madonna's Lamu stays in the corner, but the umbrella is behind um, uh, Gendrico, so he can still avoid being in the corner. Yeah. Like this. Yeah, and I don't think you have any, any punish with Gendrico. Ooh. Ooh. No, see, denied. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, he has yeah, he has to burst, he has to burst. Just avoid losing your weapon at the stage. Oh, now some some damage clips. Oh, nice! The touchdown. Oh, oh, I always hear touchdown. And now, Madonna's Lamu is bursting. No, I missed the. Oof! Full bar, and I will oh. be okay. It was a little bit of a scramble there. <laughs> Madonna's Lamu missing his weapon flipping. And it, uh, it, 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 it tried to force such a high risk uh, option like a crab, right? When a mm -hmm. uh, double jab or a double uh, 660 could have killed. Yeah, that's true. It's true, it was a bit risky. And the match goes to Madonna's Lamu, so we have 2 uh, 1. And uh, we have a winner's finals that looks like instinct for this Madonna's Lamu, so it's very interesting. And uh, we we are gonna have the next match. The next match, I think it's gonna be uh, Sunny Boy versus uh, Snake and Sam. It's gonna be yeah. losers. Yes. We're moving to losers now. Yeah. Don't uh, don't forget, guys, to go check the match arena and pop the code the TNT Samurai Twelve to help us raise that prize pot for all the players still representing. Uh, uh, Samurai Showdown in Europe. Uh, we are happy to provide the tournament and we are happy for them to compete and it would be nice to reward them uh, if you can. Cost absolutely nothing and you have various options uh, that you can find on the Macherino page to give an extra donation if you want. You know, there's rewards and there's apparels and beats and so on. Mm -hmm. like that. I'll pop that in the chat. Yeah, so spot the boys. <laughs> yeah. And I also forgot that I have um, to do with the match arena. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, so, I, I, Sunny Boy I'm and the Aomaru, right? Yeah, yeah, Sunny Boy is the Aomaru. And Snake, we know him playing yeah. Rimoruru. 
the eyes spirit. Conru. We don't get to see much the the stage. Like I'm assuming the stages are on a random rotation, but Kimui mm -hmm. Kotana, there's no, doesn't come out much. So don't you have the DLC, <laughs> Grim? What is going on? <laughs> no DLC, so we don't have. That's why. That's why I was like, I haven't seen that stage in snow at all. Oh, it's Grim's fault. Well, oh. I would say it's SNK fault. <laughs> it's like the TO should get the DLC after like, you know, 10, 12 tournaments. But okay. Mm. Let's move on. Get back. <laughs> it was just beat anyone. It was just one. <laughs> just one star. It looks a little bit laggy. With, uh, uh, yeah. yeah. Oh, damn. Walks into Andre Susan. Oh, nice. Okay. Nice blowback. Ooh. Wanted to snap it with the. Ooh. Gets it with the close heavy. Ooh, it would have to be there. Ooh. Nice. Okay. Nice, nice. He's playing guys. Try the game, you know, one on one. Jump over yeah. five or he beat. But we got some Donda case from Snaken. <laughs> Something to turn this around, nice! <laughs> ah! Big chance for the punish, he could have been an SSM there. I don't think like... Too many people keep it for round 3 and then they have no chance to land it. So might as well yeah. do a chance, go for it. Oh. Nice attempt ah. with the deflect. Okay, you can block that. Oh, you go with the, your share! Uh, he could have been DP! What happened there? <laughs> oh my. And the time is up. And Rimuru takes it. With a slight advantage. Oh no, this is gonna. <sighs> Turning him into. <clears throat> could have uh, heard... Ice Blossom. This could have hurt a lot more. Yeah, absolutely. Oh. A missed time fireball. This could be. Very, very, very tricky for 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 Sunny Boy. <laughs> Just nice. places on top of him and waited. Yeah. Gets the corner. Oh, yeah. Wanna burst there, mate? Just get out of the corner at least. <sighs> Laggy. Got, it's two hits, yeah, but we see the lag. That's a Sempure Zan. Ah, uh, it's too late for the weapon flipping and dipping. <laughs> we, got, we, we, we got the piece though. We don't need weapon. <laughs> nice. Nice block from Snake and, and this is it. Interesting because on the standing M into DP, the there's actually a natural gap. Well, not mm. like gap that you can block, but you can rage. So yeah. Rage came there to save himself. Interesting. Yeah. I don't know if he was aware or not of uh, the possibility. Yeah, maybe it was. In, it went too quick. Sometimes you just don't think about it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it could be. <laughs> Trade in the air. Delayed ice. Both both characters. Taking their distances, but now Snaking gets one hit in. Can start his offense. Ah! Didn't get the whole combo. Maybe because of the lag. Could be. Oh, nice. Stopped to just crouch kicks. <laughs> About the ice. It's interesting, it's interesting because, like, with the. I don't think I it's. Yeah, no, you need a uh, standing up. Or you, you can't really dash, it has to be instant. Yeah. Yeah, I was saying it's interesting because when the ice platform is on top of you, with a character like Aomaru or a character with DP, you can literally just dash and uh, DP them out of the platform because your, you know, your um, invincibility flames will cover you. Even if you get the trade, they, you're both gonna get knocked down, so it's not a big grip. Ooh, it's good. Ah! Bon. It's good that's gotten some damage in there. 
Mm -hmm. I was in the corner and ooh, the eye is denied. Yeah, not a great situation right now. Yeah. He has rage though. Uh, he wants this time, but he has, I think he has to burst right here, right here otherwise he won't get the chance. Yeah. Nice. One Eastern would do it if he does it really, really, really early. Or WFT? WFT. Will he burst? No. No. Why would he burst? There's another yeah. round. He's gonna have the advantage there. Plus. Yeah. Muruto. Muruto oh. still has, uh, you know, the, the, the highest plus without the weapons. So yeah, yeah he will work around it. Good job from Snaken. Yeah, nice uh, cross up jump into Konru. And this is it for this match. Snaken takes it. 2 0 for Snaken. And uh, Sonny Boy for his first. Uh, uh, ever tournament uh, for his first Sunday show. It was pretty um, uh, nice to see, and he managed to get uh, top eight. Uh, so be be happy for that. Yeah, I see in the Discord it's saying it's uh, it was a, little, um, a bit laggy. Yeah, we saw that too. Yeah, it wasn't the best connection, but hey, it's an it's an online tournament like that. Mm. That's yeah, why that's... I, re I rarely enter them. <laughs> it's yeah. like I know that it's not a. <laughs> uh, like in, my, in my in my experience, I know I don't deal well with it. So personally, I, I avoid it. But I know that like other people are fine with it and take it as it is. So mm -hmm. good job for them enjoying it. You know what I mean? Just like me. And we have uh, the next the next the next the next match. We're gonna be uh, Fraser versus Pirad or Pirad, as he mm -hmm. is French, I think. Yeah. So it's gonna be Pirade. C'est Pirade contre Fraser. <laughs> Ils vont se buter là. I'm trying to remember who Pirade uses. P Pirade uh, uses uh, Rimuru. He um, uh, did some matches against my brother, I think, and he okay. was uh, my brother was like, "Bah!" <laughs> no, I think it's Shizumaru, no? Yeah, because I remember a Shiki, but I don't remember if it was him. Uh, Shiki no, is a character that we have rarely, rarely seen. Yeah. That's because I don't participate. <laughs> <laughs> I, um, uh, I play a, a, a little bit of Shiki and, mm. and of course, Kukyo. Dans la chat, il a dit bon prononciation. <laughs> ah, ben, ben oui. Euh, <laughs> je proviens du Luxembourg, on euh, n'a pas le choix. Il parle français aussi, <clears throat> parce qu'il oui. euh, il habite en Luxembourg. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Actually, speaking too many languages. <laughs> but you can never speak too many languages, actually. No, languages are fun and they're, and they're a way to connect to people uh, mm -hmm. at a deeper level than, you know, just talking a common language. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mm, as we. Okay, no, so uh, my friends are got in. So mm -hmm. no problems. <laughs> no problems there. So match up. It's okay. A2 matchup then. Luckily. So she's on one side. Yeah, and on Gong the other Sung side. Lee, I... Yeah, yeah Gong Sung Lee is on the other one. This is going with Gong Sung Lee, so uh, really, maybe he really doesn't like the uh, the mirror match. So, or the mirror match. So uh, against uh, Pirat, he's uh, using mm -hmm. the new character. Rod Ute Ukyo Ute. <laughs> Ute Ute. Ute. Voilà, il est où? Il est où? Sunny Boy's illusion, no. It's a new player from Germany. That happens to play Aomar. <laughs> yeah. Like half of Germany, maybe. I don't know. But... <laughs> oh, no, yeah. wow. Light under the fireballs. We already get texts right off the bat. Yeah. yeah. It's like we know how to deal with this. Pirata, I'm playing. He laughed that shit. <laughs> That's kind of like, you know, you're crouching D again, uh, under fireballs uh, of KOF. Yeah. <laughs> it's funny, like, how many things uh, kind of translate from one game to another for SNK. Yeah. Oh, nice. What? <laughs> we got Reflect into Reflect. Mm -hmm. They both have an umbrella, so <laughs> they use yeah. it for that. So, who has the best umbrella? Mm -hmm. Oh. And with the tricky teleports, this, uh, yeah, it's 
to get the weapon flipping, so Shizumaru doesn't have his weapon. Mm -hmm. Stands there. Has, uh, yeah, six six D to try and get his weapon back. Yeah, oh, he just he just picks it, it up. Takes the damage. Sometimes it's smart. Even though you get damage, you still get the weapon back. So. <laughs> this now. Nah! Go the DP. Could have linked the DP there, right? Maybe he was too afraid. It was too far. I don't know. Yeah, it could be. Okay. And this round be... one goes uh, to Freza. And again, we see uh, four seconds on the clock, so those matches are really, really tiring and time-consuming. Oh, nice! Nice read from Pirat. Mm -hmm. You're chucking them fireballs. Yeah, that was you. Mm -hmm. Has been a bad boy. And now Pierad just kind of like, you know, just defending the fact that getting his free. Yeah. <laughs> uh, this guy, yeah. No! Enough. No, not high enough, because he also has the float. So he can go, you know, he can yeah, true. Uh, uh, corner jump and then get the float. Yeah, you are going to reach him unless it's like tap, tap. And again, know, we see WFT, the four which is, which is like fully block, versatile. So those yeah. matches are really, really tiring. And time was a pretty three. nice round. Oh, nice! And now he doesn't have his nice anymore. read from Pirai. Still full rage. You went Chuck. Weapon flipping on deck. Eastern on deck. Professor doing nicely. Nicely keep away game. Okay, I will burst here personally. Just kind of take away the fireball uh, game from us. Let's see what Pirat does. He just wants to, to keep it maybe. Mm -hmm. And he got some damage in. Ooh, that was the TAP on the teleport, which yeah. was marked to try and go, you know, through the button and punish her for it. Unfortunately, it did not work out for him. He could have uh. done a good fight there, but he has no. Uh, ah, I wanted to catch him by surprise, but uh, nice patience from Fresno. Yeah. And, for Fresno. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Which can work. It works against me. So. Because mm -hmm. I'm always trigger happy. <laughs> I was like, uh. okay. Nice. So, so one one meal the, for the, the the crash. Yeah, probably a good uh, good habit to have. So again, me, I, I I don't think Pirat plays another character. Yeah, we see Shizumaru again. Mm -hmm. Again, Gong Sung Lee, maybe another stage. It was nicely played from uh, Pirat. Uh, there, there, there were some punishes that he missed, um, but uh, overall his his game plan is. I think it's okay. He just has to. He just has to uh, nullify the um, uh, the fireballs. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right. But again, he's not playing against anyone. It's Fraser. Mm -hmm. Also won some of uh, the Sunday showdown, so he's not nobody. Yeah, no, definitely a good player, and also plays a lot of fighting games. When you're able to switch fighting games, you know you're a good player. Yeah, also sponsored by V Slash, so he's no joke. Shout out to the boys from V Slash. Yeah, absolutely incredible uh, organization. Mm -hmm. The ones that put, you know KOF and SNK on the map when pretty much nobody was mm -hmm. doing it. Uh, and then the um... <laughs> I meant as a team. <laughs> That's like East London fighters. Yeah, yeah, of course, as a as a TO, <laughs> like uh, East London is Oof. the major uh, organizer for uh, uh, SNK games. But I meant more as a team. But yeah, yeah. regardless, then they pick up picked up uh, uh, Arsenal Ash, of course. And, yeah. you know, they, they kind of went into the big mainstream, but they deserved it before because I used to watch their KOF 14 stuff and players, especially from the North African uh, uh, region. Yeah, pretty nice punch and very talented dudes. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. Nice, nice yeah. debate. There's not going to give you any more chance to take that round. It's like, okay, round two, let's go. So first round goes to Fraser. Ni Oof, nice. Yeah, it wasn't ready to cross up. Yeah. It's also pretty fast. 
Yeah, it's again. Oh, well, again, double cross up. Why are you blocking? <laughs> Ooh, Ooh, ouch! I got ouch. my own weapon flipping, Ethan. Let's go. Now it's even. Ah! I would, I would, I would burst, burst. He has to. Oh, nice. A bit of touch, pirate. Nah, this, then this is it. Yeah, Gets grabbed. He already burst it. So this match goes to Fraser. Mm -hmm. Nice, nicely played from Pirate. Was a nice, a nice showing. But unfortunately, it wasn't enough. Voila, that's it. Um, that's it for this match. Though. So uh, next match, I think it's going to be, and I'm gonna check this. It's going to be Instinct, Instinct versus My Don't Lamu. And uh, when, as as the players are um, preparing to join the lobby, I can remind you to uh, donate to our match arena because we have a match arena site on it. Um, the coupon is TNT Samurai Twelve. So if you don't want to um, uh, spend your own money, you can always use the coupon. Uh, and if you want, you can donate some money. We would appreciate it. And we know that the uh, $30 will go to the top three. Uh, if we get the, the price put to 100, you can even pay the whole um, uh, top eight. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, okay. Voila. So... <clears throat> We're gonna see then Yashamaru back onto